Hi guys, what I thought I'd do is I'll show you the snow in Epsom on the 27th of February 2018. Absolute bark, you know what I mean? I know quite a lot of you up north and Midlands and Norwich and that had 2.5 centimetres of snow and it's thicker than this, but this is absolute cool, very thick snow, if you know what I mean. Um, and that, so I'll just pan round and I'll show you. Yeah, it's quite bad, to be honest, if you know what I mean. Um, do let me know down in the comments section below if you've had to, ta uh, your kids are off school and if that's affected your listings, for example. Also, do let me know um, if you've got enough stock because it's going to be bad the rest of the week and, and the weekend. Also, let me know if you've had to go out in this um, snow, take your kids to school, collect them, I don't know, go to the post office, sort out parcels, go and collect stock, for example, and that. And, um, yeah, it's pretty bad at the moment in Epsom, for example, there. Yeah. So I'll pan round and I'll show you bits and pieces of it. I haven't seen this type of snow in, well, what, a year. Must be over a year with this thick down here. Oh, it was out of the laugh. My dad said the other day, right, I say, my dad said the other day, uh, and he made a quite a good joke, basically saying, well, we sort of made the joke together. He said, what's that stuff out there? I said, I said, well, it ain't cocaine, is it? <laughs> it ain't gonna snort it, are you? Well, he goes, I think it's snow. Yep, it ain't cocaine, no. <laughs> As our little personal thing, sort of thing there. So yeah, it's getting quite thick. And I know it's uh, quite a lot of people have had it thicker than this here, but I thought I'd show you anyway. And that, yeah. And so also let me know, like, for example, if you've run out of stock um, and you sort of think, damn, I can't get out because I live in a remote area and, for example, I haven't got a post office nearby. Also, and that, most of you'll be all right because you, you'll go out and get stock and stuff like that. And some of you have got to go to work anyway. So, and do let me know how the snow has affected your listing st um, stuff or affected you going out sending parcels and have you put your and have you put your eBay on a longer dispatch time because by Thursday or Friday it's gonna be mental gonna be batty is if you know what I mean the snow's gonna get thicker and heavier especially down our way southeast because obviously we ain't prepared for it well I am but south e uh, southeast the trains sus uh, southern trains and that a lot of crap they just disappear when there's an inch of snow, people get their bleeding fat Range Rovers out. You know what I mean? Start using bleeding ummers, go down the road and about, an eight, about a quarter of an inch of snow. Uh, and in there, so they'll be panicking, and, oh no, stick thousands and thousands of bread, I need bread, I need milk, I need this, that, and other for a couple of days. Shut up. You know what I mean? Deal with it. You look at the weather, you deal with it beforehand. You, you go and get a couple of slices, depending on what, how many people in your family you got. You know what I mean? People are unprepared, and the buses, car. Well, to be fair, though, buses around Epsom and Banstead and Yule and Ch Chesterton and that, and, and Kingston and that, they'll run whatever the weather. Because, obviously, the Epsom Yule Borough Council and the Kingston Council are very good at putting grit down on the roads, for example. So, I'll just open this window just to get you the full effects. It's, it's like Santa Bloody Claus, Christmas time in here. Christmas time! Snow and wine. <laughs> Ain't cocaine, is it? Christ. Bloody hell. It's mental. I think I just heard a seagull. <laughs> Lol. Anyway, I shut this because I'm freezing me bits off. Yeah, yeah, I thought I heard a seagull. <laughs> Lol. Oh, dear, dear me. I just pan myself around because I can't turn the camera around. Alright, guys. How are you? I hope you're doing well in this weather. 
Oh dear me, I'll go in a few more minutes and then I'll um, upload this later on to um, YouTube and that. Yeah, so as I said earlier, do let me know how the snow has affected you if you've had to put your eBay on bigger dispatch times because you can't get to the post office. Or, for example, you've had to, your kids have had time off school and you've not been listing because they've been either playing you up or basically needing you, for example. Um, what else? If you've had to, oh, I'm trying to think now. Um, if you've run out of stock, then how are you dealing with that? Most people haven't, but, and have you gone out to get more stock in this, we in this weather? Or have you crunched away to the post office, crunch, crunch, crunch in the fat snow you've been having? Because some people in the country haven't, haven't seen snow. There'll probably be comments down below, people haven't seen snow. Because well, what I thought I'll do with this video is show... Because um, some people, like, at the moment, a third of my subscribers, right, are from places like California and Miami, I think, some are from... Uh, stuff like that, and they don't they really, really, really get snow. And I thought I'd show people who don't get snow from my subscribers, like Stephen Steph. I think they subscribed to me, uh, Joni, whatever her name is, I forget, and some of the other people who have subscribed to me, American wise, who really don't get snow because they live around California and pot, hotter places in America. I know quite a lot of Americans do get snow and all that. Um, so I thought I'd do that and show them how <laughs> you get it quite bad. Aye, oh, dear me. Mmm. Yeah, so around the Epsom area and South East, supposed to last. Wednesday's supposed to be cold, but not snowing. Thursday and Friday's supposed to be like six inches. It's, it's minus five, it is out there. Luckily, because I had to go out to the um, Dippy Job Centre, as I said to some of you in... Uh, a live chat yesterday, I had to go to a job centre and that. I didn't realise I was in there for a course. Anyway, luckily for me, I've, um, yesterday I got a phone call at lunchtime to have a job interview at, um, Sainsbury's Kiln Lane, which is Epsom, the biggest, a big store there. And I went there this morning, it wasn't snowing, it was freezing cold, but it wasn't snowing and that. I went there about, ooh, 10 o'clock and um, when I got out it was snowing yeah because the interview is about an hour and a half because there's quite a lot you, you get free interviews because like you, you, you take all your details that like, you need to take in your passport your um, CV your um, national insurance number for example all that jazz and then uh, you had actually a million thousand questions and that and and then you've got to wait, basically I've got to wait until they phone me up to see if I've got the second interview, which is the practical. And then the third interview is today to, to, to um, do one-to-one -one interviews, for example, because you sit in a room with like 10 people. So, yeah, and anyway, I, bet I digress a bit. And when I came out, what happened was I'd um, just popped out of the door and I was like, ah, oh, Damn, it's snowing heavily, which I wish it was. And it's doing this and that. Heavy, um, heavy, um, light, heavy, light, heavy, light, snow and that. Aye. <laughs> anyway, what I'll do is I'll um, uh, get going because obviously you've seen the snow now around here and it's getting a little bit lighter and there's a bit of blue sky there and that, for example. So. Uh, please do give me a thumbs up on this, and like this video. Please do share it and subscribe. Please do hit the notifications bell and turn that notifications bell on so you get notifications to all my channels. Oh, before I forget, I'm still doing my Wednesday live. So that's tomorrow, the 28th, the last day of the month. I'm doing the Wednesday live at um, 2 p.m., so 2 o'clock there. So if you if 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 you can join, that's would be great. I've got a good to topic uh, f for that. It's, it's basically about the weather and um, how you cope with it.
for example, this type of weather and that. So hopefully I'll see you there. And what I'll do is I'll see you later. Thanks for watching. I'll see you later. See ya. Bye. Have fun.